me, it helps me kind of keep them in the catalog a lot better if I, I kind of remember who and what. Now, we had a kid named Nick Langford. He's a, I think he's a two-time D3 All-American. Um, he was real good at legs. He was terrible at everything else, right? But if he got on top, you were in trouble. He's a three-time state champ, probably one of the worst neutral wrestlers we had in our club, all right? But boy, if he got on top, he yeah, was a wrap. So what he started doing is, he, we, we taught him this, or Coach Roper, the guy I started the compound with, he taught him this power half tilt. Well, he got so good at it that everybody would do everything they could to not get caught in this power half tilt. So like I was telling this guy earlier, the more you figure out what the other guy wants to do, it's easier for you to figure out how to, how to solve the puzzle, right? So he would do the same thing we just did. He would mirror the arm, forearm on the back of the neck, windshield wiper the wrist over, and lock up this kind of reinforced power half, right? And he would start to try to drive and pull, and those guys would kind of turtle up and hip down. So all he would do was just cinch it up, dive his head in the hole, and roll through to this position, which is where we just came from. Right? So again, we're trying to turn him to his right. He fights down to his left, and we just turn him to his left. Right? So it makes life real easy for us on top, and it's even speedier on top when this guy's like, no, you're not today. You're not today. Okay? So all we're doing is we're just going to kind of set him up onto our right. Right? Maybe we've already turned him with it once, and he's felt it, and he knows it's coming. Okay? Maybe he's felt it. I attacked him here, took him down, got my legs in on top, got to my power half reinforced tilt right here. And I'm driving, I'm leaning. Then he turtles up, my head goes right behind the arm, right here. And I'm still scooping, lifting with my leg ride, here. So I'm lifting with my right leg, and I'm just rolling him through. Everything stays intact. Then when I get to my hip, boom, right to my figure four. All right, right here, all right. If I need to get my stretch, then I can. All right? Nick Langford wasn't that bad on his feet. I was just joking. But he was definitely this dog on tough on top. 